Hello and welcome to this learning video. Again, I am back with some more variety of problems on exact differential equation. So without wasting much of time, let us take uh, these problems one by one. So the very first problem is uh, this. So the given equation is this. So the given equation is, now I am solving this like m dx plus n dy. So this is m dx. So this is y cos x plus sin y plus y dx. So this is m dx and this is m dx plus n dy. So this is sin x plus x cos y plus x dy is equal to 0. Simple. So I have written this uh, systematically of the form m dx plus n dy. So you can write this is of the form. This is of the form. The matter of writing is very important. Write systematically. This is of the form m dx plus n dy is equal to 0. Okay. Now what you have to do? Write down n and n here or you can write where where m is equal to y cos x plus sin y plus y and what is n? n is this sin x plus x cos y plus x. Okay, so I have written m and n. Now next objective is to find out its derivative with respect to y and its derivative with respect to x. So what is next? Next is del m by del y is equal to. So what is my del m by del y? Derivative of this with respect to y. So keeping x constant. So this is constant derivative of y with respect to y is 1. So we get 1 into cos x cos x plus sin y derivative is cos y plus derivative of y with respect to y1. Then del n by del x. So derivative of this n with respect to x. So derivative of sin x is cos x. Derivative of this with respect to x is 1 into cos y. Now what to say? Both are same as it is visible. So you can write this implies del n by del y is same as del n by del x this shows this shows that this shows that the given this shows that the given differential equation is an exact is an exact differential equation okay now <coughs> del n by del y is same as del n by del x given equation is exact so write down its solution Therefore, therefore, its general solution is, therefore, its general solution is, what is that? Do you remember it? Now, you must remember all these things because we have already taken 4, 5 example earlier. Integration of m dx keeping y constant plus integration of terms of n terms of n containing containing y only dy is equal to constant that we write it as c okay now see here what is integration of m where is m this is m so integration of m so y cos x plus sin y plus y dx plus terms of n containing y only. Is there a term of x? No. Is there a term of x? Uh, sorry. Is there a term of y only? No. Is there a term of y only? No. x is there. Is there a term of y only? No. So, no term of y only. So, 0 dy is equal to constant. Okay, let me write that constant to be C. Simple. Now just integrate. That is integration of this with respect to x. So y is constant. Integration of cos x is 
साइन एक्स प्लस द साइन वाई प्लस वाई इज कॉन्स्टेंट सो दिस इज साइन वाई प्लस वाई कॉन्स्टेंट आउटसाइड इंटीग्रेशन ऑफ वन इज एक्स प्लस जीरो इज इक्वल टू सी और टू अवॉइड कन्फ्यूजन to avoid confusion you can just write sin y into x plus this y into x is equal to c so this is the required solution simple so i hope this problem is clear to you now i can take the second problem so second problem is also of uh, some different variety so what is the problem yes This is just like uh, fill in the blank type of thing for me. So let me write it. So what is given equation? M d x plus m d y. So this is y into sine x d x. Then this is take it to the left. So this is minus one plus y square plus cos square x d y is equal to zero. Okay? Yeah. So this is of the form m d x plus n d y equal to zero. So what is my m? My m is y into sine x, sine two x at least. So write the given portion with the full concentration to avoid any mistakes. What is n? What is n? This is my n. Let me get you. So minus one minus y square minus cos square x. Simple. Now differentiation of this with respect to y, so sine two x is constant, so one into sine two x, that is sine two x. So my del m by del y is sine two x. Now what about del m by del x? Derivative of this with respect to x is zero zero minus. What is derivative of this with respect to x? Two cos x into derivative of cos x is minus sine x. So this is two. Sine x into cos x. Okay, now most of the student uh, thought like uh, have a thought like this is sine two x, this is sine two x into cos two x. Both are not same, so this is not exact differential equation. But let me tell you that is not the case. Okay, because two sine x cos x is sine two x. So remember this. This is a very elementary. Formula of uh, trigonometrics you must remember. So as you can see, uh, del n by del y is same as del n by del x. Same then integration. <clears throat> so what is integration of m dx? My m is this. So y into sine two x dx plus terms of n containing y only. Is there a term of y? Yes, because one can be written as y to the power zero. So include constant term, separate, uh, independent constant term here in this minus term of y, correct, and no term of y. So this is this is plus integration of minus one minus y square dy is equal to constant c. So what is integration of this with respect to x? Y as it is integration of sine two x, integration of sine two x is minus cos two x. Integration of sine is minus cos two x upon divide by the coefficient of x minus integration of one is minus y minus integration of y square y cube by three is equal to c. Okay, you can give minus sign to C, or if you want, you can stop over here only, and you can write this is the required solution. So I hope these examples that I have taken in this learning video is uh, no is uh, understandable for you, and uh, that is what we have in this learning video. So thank you for watching, and keep learning. Thank you.